Hey everyone, Joe Jordy from BlackBerryOS.com here and today I'm going to be giving you guys a little video demonstration of Skype working on the BlackBerry Z10. Now this is a leaked bar file that leaked out today. Um, we know that the Skype bar file or the Skype app is in BlackBerry World for the Q10 right now but it won't be released for the Z10 officially until the Z10 gets BlackBerry 10.1, which we're guesstimating that's going to be at BlackBerry Live coming up here in a couple weeks. But for now, the bar file is leaked, and it does work on the Z10. So let's go ahead and get into that. Here it is right here. Let me try to get in a little bit closer here for you guys. Open it up. It opens up really fast, as you can see. Loads up fast. I've already loaded up before, and I've, I've messed around with it a little bit. But as you can see, the... The uh, UI and everything fits very well proportionate to the device. And what I want to do is maybe just kind of take you through little things and then I'm going to give a little video call because that's what Skype's all about, right? We can make those video calls um, even more importantly than our, our uh, regular standard calls. So let's see here. You know, we can go into recent, shows you what's going on with calls, who, who you called. Let's get out of that. As you can see, it's this is an, uh, an Android port. It's not a native app, but it does still work good, so you can tell. And this isn't even designed for... The, I'm on OS 10.0 right now, so on the Z10. So you can use it on 10.0 for sure. Let's go into my profile here. So as you can see, you can edit things, navigate around. This is kind of your back button right up there in the top left corner. You can call phones. Brings you up to a little dial pad interface. And what else we got going on here? Um, here's your little status icon up here. So I can click on that. And I can adjust, you know, if I'm away, if I'm online. All right, so now I'm going to jump into my contacts here. And I'm going to give Mr. John Reed a call. It looks like he's up and ready to go. He should be expecting me. So we're going to test out this video chat feature. Here we have the options, voice call video call. Let me kind of try to get in there a little bit farther. Send an instant message. You also have more. Instant messaging send works fine. Voice call works fine. But do keep in mind that video calling is a little bit buggy. So because you know obviously this isn't the final version for the Z10. So let's go ahead and try the video call to John Reed. He's over there in the UK right now. Let's see if we can get him to pick up. Nope. Oh, okay, so we see him. But the call hasn't completely gone through yet, so let's just give it a minute. And the ringing has stopped. Oh, let me try to turn this up. Can you hear me, John? I can hear you. Great. Are you on your Z10? Oh well, over here we say Z10, so let's just leave it at that. <laughs> so as you, so yeah, how, how do you, how do you like Skype on the on the on the Z10, the Z10 so far? Z10 so far. So I've got a running better than I was expecting it to. It does it does have some good delay, and it is it is quite buggy on the video calling, right? Mm -hmm. All right, well, I'm going to let you go, buddy, so have a good night. You probably got to get to sleep, huh? Take care. All right. So as you can see, a successful Skype call with John Reed over there in the UK. It did turn out pretty well. Um, like I say, there was some delay, a little bit of echo, but, you know, not every call is the same. I've had a couple calls already that I've I've experienced that, that have turned it out, uh, that have turned out well, so... That is going to wrap it up for today from BlackBerryOS.com. Uh, check out the blogs, guys, and go to the site, and you'll be able to find out where you'll be able to find this bar file. 
uh, to get Skype on your Z10 and how to install it as well. So check the blog there and we'll have all the information for you. Thanks for tuning in everyone.